In this video, we will find out the changes in matter in the presence or absence of oxygen. After this video lesson, you would be able to determine the changes in matter in the presence of oxygen and determine the changes in matter in the absence of oxygen. Take a look at this video. And after how many seconds, it turned out this way. What do you think might be the reason? The changes in the color of the inner part of the eggplant is due to its exposure to oxygen. So what should we do then for this to be avoided? First, you place it in a large bowl of water with a teaspoon of salt dissolved in it. And then, the water should be enough for all the sliced eggplant to dip in fully. This is to prevent the oxygen present in the air to react with the chemicals present in vegetables. Let us take a look at this. Do you think the fire will continue its flame in the absence of oxygen? If we are going to cover the burning wood with basin, the wood will not be burned. Combustion is also known as burning. In combustion, oxygen, fuel, and heat are always present as you can see in our illustration here. How about this picture? What is this? Of course, that is a fish kill. Now, the primary cause of fish kills is a low concentration of dissolved oxygen in the water. The next one. How about this snail? Can you see? It is rusting already. You know what? Rusting is caused by the reaction of iron with oxygen present in the air. This kind of reaction is, is lower than the rate of combustion. The amount of rust formed in an iron depends on the moisture and humidity of the surroundings. An iron can be prevented from rusting by covering the surface with paint, oil, or grease. These help to prevent rusting by stopping oxygen and moisture from having contact with the surface of the iron. Now let us see if you understood our lesson. You read the statement carefully and identify if each stated effect is a change in the presence or absence of oxygen. There is a change in color of the inner part of some fruits and vegetables. I'll give you 5 seconds to answer. And the answer is... The presence of oxygen. Number 2. The fire will continue its flame when there is continuous supply of oxygen. And the answer is presence of oxygen. Number 3. The color of some sliced fruits and vegetables remain. And the answer is absence of oxygen. How about number four? There will be no fire. And the answer is absence of oxygen. The last one, the rust formed in an iron. And the answer is, presence of oxygen. There you go. 
Please remember that the presence or absence of oxygen has various effects on matter. Among these common ones are combustion or burning and resting. Fire will continue its flame provided that there is continuous supply of fuel, oxygen, and heat. In the absence of oxygen, there will be no fire or flame that will occur. An example of change in the matter when oxygen is present is rusting. Rust is formed when iron and oxygen react with water or air moisture. There you are kids, before I end, I would like to leave this to you. Let us always care our environment so we won't suffer the most.